Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm the sewer fan. Um, just wanted to come at you. This is going to be one of my last videos ever. So, um, I've kind of decided to, I think, take a break from collecting in a while. This is my personal decision. Nobody else has anything to do with it. Um, I decided to take a break for a while. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really getting a whole lot of stuff done. Like, um, I'm not making any trades or something. Like, it just really, like, my cards are just sitting here doing nothing. Like, I've, I've been trying to get big cards for people so we can trade and actually, so I can actually have fun with this. But it's not working out the way I thought it was going to originally. So, um, it's kind of my personal decision. I'm, I'm going to stop. But what I'm going to do is sell all my cards. Um... Well, first, let me let me share this with you because I, is this is how I came to the decision. Um, Monday, I came home from school. I'm in high school. Came home from school. Um, I had a sore throat, so my um parents, they called the um health department, said that my grandson has a sore throat and um a runny nose. So they scheduled me to come in Tuesday morning. Well, when I got, so what I was thinking, and my grandparents did agree with me, it was probably, because I have allergies, it was probably just allergies. It's allergy season right now. And runny nose and a sore throat, that's all sounds like allergies to me, because I get that once every year, around the same exact time. But we we, we just wanted to go in just to get the allergy medicine that I do get, which is Zyrtec or whatever, I don't know. But anyways, um, I go on Tuesday morning, and um, the doctor, I never saw this lady before. This is a new doctor, I guess. The doctor says that I have second second stage of swine flu. Now, I was trying to reason with her that the stages which is on which is what she told me this this is what she told me swine flu this the symptoms were sore throat runny nose a major headache and vomiting i don't have a major headache i don't have um i'm not vomiting at all but i do have a sore throat and a runny nose which a good doctor to me would reason that it's probably allergies. So just give me allergy medicine and come back in a day or two. Well, this doctor says I have second stage of swine flu. And she suggests me staying home from school from a week. I'm a junior in high school. I have a whole lot of work to do this year. The, I don't know if she understood that or whatever, but that's the whole thing. She And she told me to stay, there, stay home from a week from school. And, um, basically do nothing. So then two hours after I leave the health department, I take it upon myself to go to CVS, pick up Claritin. I got some Claritin, took it about three, four hours later, sore throat gone, runny nose stopped. Hmm. So, but I still can't go to school because the doctor contacted my school and told her that I'm not supposed to be in school. So, I just wanted to share my thoughts because that's a little frustrating. I've been frustrated for the last two days, sitting home, doing nothing. And I've been thinking, and that's how I came to my conclusion, going back to why I'm pretty much going to stop collecting cards. I mean, I might, you might see me buy a box every now and then but I'm not going to collect anymore I'm straight selling uh, I don't I don't want cars I don't want to just sit there and look at cars I have so many cars that just sit there and do nothing I thought I was gonna be able to make trades and stuff or sell some but that's not happening so I just figure I'll go straight selling but I, yeah, I just wanted to share my that story because that was really frustrating. I mean, that's a good doctor would say that I have allergies, which I did tell her that I get that I get once a year, sore throat, runny nose, once a year, 
I don't believe two, three years ago, um, swine flu, they didn't really know about swine flu back then. So why would you conclude this time that it's swine flu? I realize it's precautions or whatever, but it wasn't it wasn't even severe sore throat. It was just a little scratchiness. But whatever. I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um and also make the announcement that I'm basically stop going to stop collecting cars. Um I have a whole lot of base cars, insert cars, and as you know, hits pretty high end, stuff like that. Jonathan Stewart's for Panther fans or whoever. Um I'm gonna let you guys go first. I'm gonna let you two be able to get at get at these cards first. Um, I just made a video about the Deshaun Jacksons. All that all that stuff is still here for trade and everything, and um, plus all the other boxes and stuff I have, and that's basically it. I mean. I, w I would love to keep on going, but it's, it's just really taking up too much time, too much money, stuff like that. So, and I, I got to get ready for other stuff. Like, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to, I don't know. I, I, it just feels like so much of my life, ever since I started collecting, it's been pretty much going away. So, that's what, that's my decision. I'm pretty much going to stop. Yep. Um... Once again, hit me up. Let me know if you want to buy anything. Again, um, I'm selling all these cards for cheap. Um, the video about the Deshaun Jacksons I'm just made. Scratch that. I'm not selling from eighty. I'll go down to sixty. I'll go down. No, I'll go, sorry, not sixty. I didn't write that down. I'll go down to seventy. Okay. Uh, I know it's ten dollars off, but I, like these things are worth some money. I do know that. Um. Oh, again, please do not comment the bottom of this video that these Deshaun Jacksons go for such and such on eBay. If they go for that much on eBay, then go buy them on eBay. This is an announcement. Go buy them on eBay if they go for that much on eBay. Don't complain to me saying that they go for much less. Which they don't. The triple jersey autograph goes for about 30 to 35, maybe 40. The patch autograph, which I haven't saw one exactly like it, that goes for, I'm guessing, around 40 to 50. Deshaun Jackson is a pretty expensive player. So I reason that I'm giving you guys a deal by selling them for 70 to 80 dollars, which is probably what you're going to about spend. Bidding, bidding on it, on buying it now on eBay. Plus, that the price I'm giving you is including shipping. So, I'm just asking you, please don't complain about the prices. All the other cars, I mean, the John Seward, of course, that I have a pretty bit lock in, lot of that. So, it's going to be a, it's going to be a nice price. It's going to be cheaper than regular, but it's going to be a nice price. Um, All the other cars, I'm selling for cheap, you know, um, no more than Pretty much almost every other card, no more than like twenty five dollars and under. That's pretty much what I'm gonna do. Um, so message me. I have a whole lot of cards, base cards, inserts, hits, and stuff. Message me your team or whatever, and that's what I'm gonna do. All right. Uh, hit me up. Comment at the bottom. Do not comment me about eBay. I hate that. Please don't do that. And um, I guess that's it. All right.